Hi, I'm Nick Salazar with TriRig.com. I'm here with Matt Steinmetz at Retool Studios in Boulder. And today we're here with Craig Alexander, two-time Ironman Hawaii World Champion, and we're going to be doing a lactate test. So, Matt, explain to us what a lactate test is. A um, lactate test involves the sampling of blood um, across a, a range of workloads to obtain a blood lactate curve. Okay, and how does the protocol work for the test we're going to do today? Um, this protocol we'll do is he'll come in and he'll do a 20 to 30 minute warm up, and then after, in that warm up, we'll take a baseline. And then we'll take every five minutes, we'll increase the workload that Craig will be um, riding at in order to obtain the curve. Okay, so basically you've got him sitting on a trainer. He's pumping out 200 watts every five minutes. You just increase the watts, 20 or 30 watts. You take a finger prick, put the blood in the machine, and get some numbers out. Correct. Okay. So you guys did this once before earlier in the season when Craig maybe had some more top end speed. Yeah, we did this test back in July when Craig had a more half Ironman short course uh, focus where he was doing a lot more intensity. So the purpose of this second test is first to compare it to that test, but also he's just finished his Kona build. So you know, I really want to see you know, what changes we have made to that curve and see if there's any areas where we feel that, you know, can need some tweaks here and there um, to make Craig a better athlete. Perfect. So maybe what we're looking at is sort of the middle of this range of the lactate curve to hopefully see that Craig is able to pull his middle range power for longer without building more lactate. Is that the yeah, that, I mean, that's exactly, yeah, that's exactly what we're looking for. We're really, um, you know, the, the whole focus of you know, his, his Kona build is to really work on, you know, the power requirements to ride in that main group. You know, in order to do so, he's got to be able to handle, you know, some surges and some spike and some spikes of power and be able to, you know, recover it, you know, sub-threshold efforts. Perfect. Thanks very much, Matt. You're welcome. For more information and photos, log on to trier.com.